Hey Hunter, Parker and I cooked something up and we think you should be a part of it. Oh, you know, if, if you're free. I could be free. Right on. Then let's head over to the shop and... Ah, oops. Almost spoiled the surprise. <laughs> Tell you what, if you come with me just for a bit, I promise we won't waste your time. All right. Where are we headed? Oh, it's not too far. I can't wait till you see it. Hey, you made it. Told you. You want to give the rundown or should I? I got this. Welcome to the shop. What is this place? For me, it's a piece of home away from home. Quite a setup. What need does it fulfill? All kinds. Usually, I work on the Hell Ride and Parker tinkers with his web gadgets. And as we do, we brainstorm ideas of what we could work on together. You call it the shop? But I see nothing for sale. That's the beauty. For me, it's an auto shop. For Parker, it's a workshop. We're both wondering what it's going to be for you. There must be a reason you do this here instead of the Forge. Two reasons. Tony Stark and Doctor Strange. We wanted a place with good vibes and less bickering where we could focus on a project without the smartest men in the world telling us how to do it better. The shop is where you work things out for yourself. I understand why the two of you are here, but why invite me? Caretaker always described you as someone who worked with their hands. You made things. You did the work. So we want to make things with you. Help you do the work. Caretaker used to tell me to pick up my clothes from the floor every day. Sounds like you and Nico have something in common. Why not let Parker give you a quick rundown on our current project? After that, we'll close up the shop. All right. It's all pretty neat, huh? There's not enough here to give you a tour, but... I did want to show off our first project. Don't have a name for this yet, but if you run into Eddie again, uh, Venom, we think this could give you an edge. When we fought Eddie, the symbiote reacted strongly to your presence. It noticed something about you and tensed up. Our project takes advantage of this. This project of yours, what does it do? Our first prototype dulls your presence around the symbiote. Makes you harder for Eddie to notice. So, a uh, symbiote muffler? Ha! <laughs> it is now. The other prototype will help if you're ever caught in Eddie's tendrils. It blasts a distracting subsonic pulse that should give you time to both fight your way out and hit him with a counter. Like your zingers that keep him distracted? You know, Robbie and I should let you name all our projects. Then we need to miniaturize it so it fits in your suit. But we can have it ready pretty quick. I look forward to seeing it in action. I knew you'd be into this! We are going to make so many weird things together! Oh yeah, I can scrounge enough components to finish this project, but if there were more, we'd have more options. I'll put together a list and send it to your spark. Bring what you can next time you're here. All right. turn out. 
Better than expected. Sick. That's about it. I'm going to stick around and work on this. So, that's the shop. What do you think? You and Parker have outdone yourselves. Then think of what the three of us can do. I'll give you a heads up before shop class meets again. Shop class? Right. That's what we're calling our time here. See you then. Parker, you sticking around? You're asking me if I'm sticking around? 